go are you willing to believe because too many as many that will believe is as many as he gives the power to become the sons this is not tied to the will of the flesh nor is it tied to the will of God but this you can only get through Jesus Christ this you can only get through God this you can only get through the theos hallelujah this you can only get through Elohim the triune God God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit working in concert with his own son. This you can only get from, we ain't talking about Buddha. You can't get this from Buddha. Hallelujah. Buddha does not give out Ezusius power. Hallelujah. You can't get this, get this from Hare Krishna. You can't. You can't get this from any other faith. Hallelujah. It's got to be faith in God, the only true God. His name is Jesus. He is the Christ. He is the anointed one. Hallelujah. He's the one that died on the cross and bore all of our diseases and sicknesses and our sins on the cross. You can't get this from nobody else but Jesus. When you call on the name of Jesus, you shall be saved. He says to many of them that will believe, that's all you got to do. It's not tied to your good work. You can't do. You can't do enough to get what I have for you. You can't do enough. He said, in fact, you to do is to be. Because if you be, then you will do. If you be all, then you will do all. Because stop getting caught up with, I gotta do this, I gotta do that, I gotta do this. No, just be. Hallelujah. Just be in God. Be his servant. Be a worshiper. Be a praiser. Hallelujah. Be a holy vessel unto the Lord. And you will do what you are. You are what you do. You do what you are. Hallelujah. So when you become the are, the do will flow out of you. Hallelujah. The do will flow out of you. Because God does what he does because of his own good pleasure. That's why he does what he does. To be or not to be. That is the question. Let us stand to our feet. Do you realize today that you have the power? We're talking about exousia. We're talking about the power that means authority. It is the God delegated power. God delegates to us power. He only delegates it to those who are his sons who have enough persuasion, who are persuaded and have enough belief in him that believe you are the God. You are the source of my strength. You are the strength of my life. There's no reason for me to look anywhere else because you are the Christ. You are the one. You are. Holy God is. He is. Before the foundation of the, of the earth, God is. But how many of us believe that? How many of us believe that we are the righteousness of God? Do we really, really believe that we are heirs and joint heirs with Jesus Christ? And you are a chosen priesthood, a holy nation. You have been called out of darkness into the marvelous light to show forth. Hallelujah. To show forth my glory. To show forth my anointing. To show forth my praise. To show forth for me. He said you are. You are a priest. You're a royalty. Do you believe that you are royalty? This altar is open right now. Let's open up the altar to 